Hey there guys, how is it going? My name is Anthony and welcome back to another Minecraft 1.8.3 seed showcase for my channel. Now today I am going to be showcasing an amazing seed. You pretty much have everything you could want at spawn. You have an NPC village right there as you can see, you have two dungeons, you have a desert temple, and you also have about 14 diamonds really close to the spawn as well, and an abandoned mineshaft. So um, yeah, without further ado, let's go ahead and get straight into today's seed. If you guys do enjoy the video, then be sure to give this video a like as it is going to help me out a huge bunch. And if you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, then be sure to subscribe as well and be sure to leave a comment you know because I love talking to people in the comments section and uh, if you have any seeds you want me to showcase or anything then be sure to comment those as well and uh, yeah that's basically it so without further ado as I've said let's go ahead and get straight into the video so I will leave the coordinates on screen right here as you can see and uh, the first thing we're going to check out is of course the NPC village right here and it does indeed have a blacksmith so let's go ahead and check out the loot now in the chest you know you have a bunch of iron armor which is epic you have a bunch of ironing gets as well so that is a really awesome start for an npc village at the spawn you have a bunch of iron and you also have iron armor as well so the next thing i am going to check out is a dungeon now the dungeon the first dungeon in the seed is actually really close to the spawn it is located at these coordinates right here you just have to dig down right here and you will find the first dungeon in the seed now in the chest you know you just have some iron some bread and some cds and stuff like that and some buckets now i reckon the music disc is probably the highlight of this dungeon uh the loot isn't too great but the fact that you get a cd is pretty cool i guess so uh, the next thing we are going to check out is the second dungeon so to find the second dungeon uh, you basically just need to go to these coordinates which are located over here and as you can see the uh, dungeon is located at these coordinates so if we go down here you will see there is a second dungeon with a double chest right here now this dungeon is a little bit better you get a name tag you get a book with fortune 2 which is pretty good you've got a few buckets some uh, bread and a bunch of wheat and some saddles and stuff which is awesome as well but i reckon the enchantment book and the name tag uh, is the highlight of this dungeon and uh yeah that's pretty much it so the next thing i am going to be showing you all is uh the diamonds in the seed now the first load of diamonds are actually located at these coordinates right here you basically just want to go down at these coordinates and you will find a bunch of diamonds here and uh yeah that's pretty much it and you also have an abandoned mine shaft right here but we have one two three four five six diamonds so if we go ahead and spawn those in one two three four five six you will have uh, six diamonds, which is pretty awesome. So uh, yeah, that's a pretty epic start for diamonds, to be honest. Uh, six whole diamonds, really close to the spawn. And uh, yeah, that's basically it for the first load of diamonds. Now, the second bunch of diamonds are actually located at these coordinates right here. If you dig down at this area, you will find some more diamonds. You will find one, two, three more diamonds right here, as you can see. So let's go ahead and spawn in three more diamonds. And as you can see, you still have the abandoned mine shaft as well, uh, which is pretty epic. And uh, yeah, that's basically it. So the final thing I am going to show you guys is the desert temple in the seed. Now, there are two desert temples in the seed. There is also one located off in that direction. Uh, but the chest loot in that desert temple isn't very good. Uh, you've just got, you know, iron and stuff. It's, it's not too great. Uh, but this desert temple, on the other hand, is a lot better. We're going to go ahead and check out the chests uh, in, these desert, in this desert temple right here. So in the first chest, you have two diamonds, which is awesome. In the second, you have an enchantment book with fire protection and and three more diamonds so that totals us up to 14 and in this chest you just got some bones which is pretty good if you want to tame a wolf or something and in this chest you have a saddle now that is also pretty good uh, if you want to tame a horse or something and uh, you can also dig down underneath the temple and you will find an abandoned mine shaft right here it's the same mine shaft we've been seeing uh, throughout the video and uh, yeah, that is basically it for the seed. Overall, I think it's a pretty good seed. You've got some amazing things at spawn, uh, which I think is awesome. You've got a bunch of dungeons. You've got diamonds. You have an abandoned mine shaft. You also have that village with the blacksmith at spawn. And as you can see, there is another desert temple right here, as you can see. Uh, I guess we might as well just check it out for the sake of it being here. So let's go ahead and enter this desert temple right here. Uh, so there is another desert temple located at these coordinates. So if we go into this desert temple and check out the chest loot, you will notice Notice that you just have some gold and some saddles and stuff. Uh, it's not too great. You've just got, you know, gold and iron and stuff. 
and some bones. And uh, yeah, that is pretty much it for the last desert temple. And that's pretty much it for the seed overall. So I really hope you all enjoyed today's seed video. I just want to thank you all so much for the amazing support on the last seed video. We got over 10,000 views in like one day, which is really epic. And I really do appreciate the support on my channel. It's epic. Uh, but yeah, thank you all so much for watching. If you guys do enjoy the video, as I said, then be sure to give this video a like. And if you're new to my channel, then be sure to subscribe. But uh, yeah, thank you all so much for watching. And I will see you all in tomorrow's video. Goodbye!